browsing. Just like in a Santa Cruz, there are a lot of these sea lions chilling. Eventually I reached the place named The Rock, so apparently it's maybe this one I'm sitting currently on or that one, but anyway, there's a lot of rocks around, so I don't know <laughs> which one is The Rock, but anyway, it's very nice to see here and uh, enjoy the ocean view. Apparently it's somehow different from San Diego. I don't know exactly why. Yeah, first of all, it's maybe much more greener and but warmer on the same on the same side, and maybe colors a little bit different. Uh, well, anyway, it's great to be here, it's Cape Town, and um, the people are very friendly here. I know. For instance, I had a problem with my with my parking ticket. Ticket the machine didn't didn't take it. Just returned, and I approached the guy uh, who was staying there with the radio. So I guess he's kind of security or something. And uh, yeah, I explained my problem, and he said, "Well, yeah, sure. So this sometimes happens." And uh, he took my ticket and went to another machine, stayed in the line with me, and then basically tried. It was the same problem, so he called the support, 
and uh, explain the situation. I believe in, in the native language because <laughs> I couldn't really understand what's going on there and they were talking about. But in the end I just got a new ticket and I paid for it and, and it was pretty friendly. And so it's great to be here.
uh, flowers Ether, ethery, and uh, it's very similar experience to Italy. You know, this chain of uh, kind of market like uh, high quality of market like like uh, supermarkets. So it's like Italy, but instead of I, it's E A Italy, like Italy. And uh, I visited in Turin years ago and. Uh, basic idea is that you have like a very a lot of small shops uh, organized as a single supermarket so just it's a seamless uh, shopping experience so to say and um, they have like a buffet you can buy some uh, fresh vegetables fruits bakery i don't know they they this uh, other stuff it's very nice and you yeah, now check the quality <laughs> So it happened to me to end up in South Africa, in Cape Town. I mean, not fully end up. I will come back to Hamburg tomorrow. I have a flight in the evening. Well, doesn't matter. Uh, I mean that this was very spontaneous uh, trip. Uh, frankly speaking, I didn't want to go because it's kind of far away like 15 hours traveling from Hamburg uh, but then circumstances was that I end up here and I'm deeply touched uh, by the hospitality of, this, uh, of the people here and uh, in overall it's over exceeded my ex expectations which I probably didn't have any that's why <laughs> maybe it's so so good uh, I mean it's the apartment where I stay in is just amazing it's like uh, one of the best apartments I've ever stayed and I was in many apartments including like uh, 45th floor and 50th floor in uh, Moscow city and things like that and this one has almost uh, like entire apartment is uh, walls and windows except this corner here but other than that it ha gives you a great view almost I don't know 100, 180 watts not 360 but quite a, quite a view and it's very you know designish and stylish and has everything like fully functional kitchen and a lot of stuff so it's even in the bathroom you have a shower and a bath unfortunately i had no chance to take the bus but the best uh, but yeah maybe next time and then definitely i want to come back maybe for a longer time like i don't know minimum like three months because for that you don't need even any visas it was at least russian passport or any other I think EU passport and American passport would be the same. You just uh, can stay here for three months without anything. And if you want to stay longer, you will need to apply for some kind of business visa. But I think they have something uh, like digital nomad visa where you just say, okay, I will work remotely for my company and just stay in, uh, in the South Africa. And Cape Town is very great. I mean, it's like in the United States in a miniature, so it's uh, kind of you have a New York like downtown, uh, then these views, surroundings, nature, absolutely incredible, and uh, yeah, it's basically everything in, in one place. Everyone speaks English, and uh, the only thing is that this like opposite uh, driving, which requires some brain activity to get acquainted with and uh, get used to it but other than that after just one of several days i quite convenient was driving here and uh, yeah definitely look forward to come back and this, this is great great city and uh, great people and i'm really I'm really glad i came here <laughs>
claim my VAT taxes back. It was procedures quite straightforward. I just gave them all, all the recipe I found in the trash can <laughs> just before leaving the apartment. And they give me the paper. Uh, so apparently it should be like 30 euros or we'll see in reality. But yeah, the procedure is anyway very straightforward and friendly. It's nobody there. Quite fast and uh, friendly stuff. So great experience.